right, I'm Brian with the HVAC School Podcast. Today I want to show you how you can use the Testo Smart Probe, specifically the 605Is, in order to measure the exact BTUs that your air conditioning or heating equipment is delivering to the space. So if you look inside the new Smart Probes case, if you take out the two 605Is, you want to make sure that both of the end probes are open, and then go ahead and install one in your return duct, and then one in your supply duct. Next thing you need to do while the temperatures are settling in, you need to go ahead and set in your airflow. And that would be a good time to use your 405i hot wire anemometer in duct to take that measurement and to enter it in. Now we've already done that and we came up with a calculation of 730 CFM, but let me show you how to configure that measurement. You go in, you hit the gear at the bottom, hit configure measurement. You can do it manually by hitting manual and then typing in the 730 CFM on the return air because that's where we measured it. Keep in mind when measuring that you want to measure at a point of low turbulence and do a full traverse. All right, so the system that we're working on is a 24,000 BTU system. The system is actually delivering us 23,400 BTUs. So you can see that we have a 55.4 degree supply air, 55 degree supply air, 76 degree return air. We also have our wet bulb temperature as well as our dew point displayed in the app. What we provide our customers with is BTU capacity of cooling and heating. It gives you a really good way to show that you're giving the customer exactly what they paid for. This has been a demonstration of using the cooling and heating load feature on the Testo Smart Pro app using the new Smart Probes case. Thanks for watching.